Hello there, and welcome to episode 43 of this series, where I try to play Europe region by region on GeoGuessr. And I'm doing so in a tennis match format, meaning that every time I get a 5,000 point round, I get a point, like a tennis point, and when I don't, well, GeoGuessr gets a tennis point. And uh, we have just started the third match. I'm 2 0 up in the first set, and I'm leading the third game 40 love. And that's in spite of the new rules I've imposed on myself for this match, which is that uh, no round shall last more than 8 minutes, and in a round that lasts more than 8 minutes, I forfeit, as well as uh, I will knock 3 minutes off the uh, total game time available to me for each perfect round I get. And initially, the game time I have available to me is 40 minutes. So um, we will see how that goes. So far it has not posed a significant trouble to me, although I did have run into trouble with the eight minute limit in the last couple of episodes. So we will see how it goes today. <coughs> Excuse me. Today's episode brings us to Hungary. <coughs> and we're going into Walsh County. Um, Hungarian is notoriously hard to pronounce, uh, given that it's well, it's actually not that hard to pronounce. It's more that the that um, and that the combination of letters is rather different from what you expect in other languages, uh, in the producing somewhat different sounds from what you would be used to in other places in in Europe. So um, once you get the hang of the pronunciation, it's not that hard. But uh, it's been way too long since I traveled in Hungary, so I'm a little, well, I'm actually quite rusty on on how things are pronounced, so please bear with me. Um, so, Vos is, um, as you can see, on the uh, on the Austrian border, and um, is a uh, county of 3,336 square kilometers, and uh, the capital of which is Sambate, or Sambate. Um, so S Z is is a regular S. Uh, and uh, well, I, so yeah, and uh, there's about what? How many people are living in, in this area? There's uh, two hundred fifty-three thousand people living in in Vos County. And uh, well, I don't really know what they do there. There's, uh, but, um, well, Hungary is a nice place. I, it's one of the countries I've enjoyed visiting in the past. I can see there's a... There's a bit of... There's a smattering of mountains, maybe. Nah, not really. Most of Hungary is fairly flat. And I think we'll find that most of this is fairly flat as well. So, let's just head out and see what Vos has in store for us. Well, that is helpful. Crossing a ra railroad, that is helpful, but of course we have to figure out where this thing is. And uh, let's see, I'm just going to check this. Uh, I sort of thought... No, it's not a pub, it's just a... just a mural. Okay, and the yo Yokai Utsa. And, oh, okay. So we can get to Sumeg and Seldomelk. Sumeg and Seldomelk. I've seen the name uh, Seldomelk. And that is off to the west. No, that can't be right. Uh, well, it's, uh, of course it is right, but uh, yeah, and then we're gonna go on to Sumeg to the east. I have a feeling that it's Sumeg and the seldom milk. So So I'm pretty much midway between, so I guess we're down here in Janos. Janos Hazo, Hazo. And that could make sense. Is there a railroad here? There is. 
So could we have been... Could we have been here? But yeah, that's a yokai. Yokai Utsa. That's what just came out of. And we can go out to Karako. Karako is here, yeah. Or Koroko, I think. As far as I remember, in Hungarian, the A without an accent is O, and with an accent is A. And I guess the O with an accent is O. So Karako, Koroko. Right, so we're right on the railroad. And we, yeah, should be here. And we were. So that means I win the third game. 3 0, as I was 40 up in it already. Right. That was an. That was a soft start to Vosh. And. Uh, let's see, what's this? It kind of looks like a school or college building or something. At least it would be if it was in Norway and Hungary, I wouldn't know. Um, okay, that doesn't help me any. A pavilion of some sort. Does it say anything? Well, not, not, that, any, not anything that I can spot. Right, so we're on the main road in some town or village. Let's see, this street hasn't got a name that they okay, here we go Bershek Yosef Yosef Bershek Yosef yeah that's another thing in Hungary they uh, like they do in Japan they have they put the surname first mm. so Irop Iropko Nature Park, okay. Uh, where might that be? And the name of this street Kirai Kirai Vilge Kirai Vilge or something like that. L Y is makes a sort of y sound or a. Uh, so in, if you spell spell it out Kirali, it will be Kirai, and it's Hunyadi. What's uh, Hunyadi? I wasn't that. Doesn't that mean king or something? Ah. Uh, Okay, so we're actually in a proper town. And uh, there's a spa in about a kilometer. Forgot to. A cobor much much car horse. So, well, it doesn't help me any. Hmm. Here we go. Let's see. Mm. So, Sombate, Sombate hey, is uh, on the 87 going through town. Okay, so the 87 goes through town. Here's the 87. And Sombate is to the northeast. So, so what was Sombate? Yeah, so, okay, so, right. So we could be anywhere around here. Um, where does this road lead then? Does it say anywhere? Okay, so what's the name of the street then? Doesn't say either. Hmm. But Ovaros, Ovaros, Kirai, Kirai Völd, something in that. And then we got a skiing hill, the Sabo Sabo Hedge. 
and Cursigfalva. That might actually be the more. And another nature reserve. So the 87 goes from Come, Sombate, and onwards. Kersig, there's something called Kersig here. Sorry, not Kersig, Kersig. So I'm wondering if we might actually be in Kersig. Even though Sombate is off to the well, temporarily at least the northeast and east. What does it say on this side of it? Now those were just hmm. let's just move a little through town here. Now we're going southeast, and that is more. Let's see now. I'm thinking we're somewhere here, but then I just need to figure. <sighs> this must be the main street, but the street in town. And this is called the. Ah, Ferenc Ferenc Rakorci, Otsa. Going straight north. So that is this street here. But it's going straight north. This one is not going straight north. Unless we... Yes, this is where we are. So we got... Uh, the Photoshop here? Yes. Finally. Okay, so we came down... This road, that's the uh, Hunyadi Street, and we were on the, let's see, there was, that's the Bershek Yosef, so we must have been on the Park Street here somewhere, that's the Pavilion, oh, how am I doing on time, I've got a minute and a half, okay, so the Pavilion is up there, this is St. Imre's Mission, or something? And so, yeah, so we are here. That was a tough one, but I got it within time. So that's 15 love. Down to 30, what? Down to 34 minutes on the clock. Okay. Um, Hotel Melani, Melani. Yeah. Now, which is the sensible way to go here? There's a water tower over there, and then we're coming up on the town here. It seems called Saint Gotthard. Okay, and that's over here, and we're moving eastwards. So let's see if we can find that. Let's see if we can find that hotel. What was it called again? Six kilometers outside the town center. All right, okay, so there's a fair distance to go. And it was Melani. The hotel Melani. Uh, I mean, six kilometers. We could always be here in Madjarlaki. Uh, Let's see, the road is going slightly northwest. Uh, no, I'm not getting anything out of this. So. Now, wait a minute. What? So, six kilometers to the St. Gotthard Center. That way, and then it says Saint Gotthard over here, and Jakob ha Jakob Hazel. Can we find ja Jakob Hazel? So what does it say?
Well, that's confusing. St. Gotthard that way, and we're leaving St. Gotthard here. We're on the E66 and the 8. And there's jo Jakob Hazel. Hazel. There's Hotel Milani. Um, Calling me greatly confused. Okay, so here's a road going down south, and I guess it's this one. No, it can't be. Can it? Or is it this? No, it can't be that one. Because then we have passed. Then we have passed the hotel. So it must be here. But. Huh. Yeah, this is a. Confusing one, alright. Let's see. Um, can we find those? There's no end of houses here. So let's see. So the road does a squiggly thing. That must be this. We're coming up on a bus stop, which must be here. So that means the thing I was looking at must. Well, the road I was looking at must have been that. And that's no less confusing. Let's see, and on the bend here, there's a road here. Right, so that's this road. So the road I was looking at was that. How on earth does, does this compute? There's a building over there, which must be this stuff. I reckon. So that brings the question of this dike or drainage ditch or whatever it is. Which must be going down along the side of this field. Or northwest. I must be standing right on top of the thing. About there. We'll try that. Oh, and it was right. Huh. 30 love, and I'm down to 31 minutes. Okay. Um, yeah, but I only got 60 minutes left of round times, so. Okay, so we're heading out of a city by the look of it. How am I supposed to get that one right? Oh, wow. So I'm in the middle of a field. Uh, now, if the image would load, okay, there we go. Much obliged. Oh, that one is going to be hard to get right. Oh, here it's paved. Huh. Okay. Um, so, which town is it that we're skirting here then? Which way should I go? Let's try and go eastwards. Hmm. Yeah, this one is not going to be simple, I have a feeling. Some kind of school, maybe? Okay, and a brook of sorts, and then we're coming into Sombate. Are we coming into Sombate from the west? Okay. So I guess... Guess we're on the 89. We could also be here about. Well, let's keep on checking. Let's see, gas station in 300 meters, and. What is this area then? And 
unfortunately no street names. But we have an intersection coming up. Now that's the Z Rocks. <laughs> Not to be confused with another company, I think. And uh, unfortunately no street names. Well, there might be one on. Okay. We send to Utsa. Okay, uh, Utsa. Let's see if we can find that crossing one of the streets into town. I don't think it's this one. Well, it has to be over here, and I don't think it's that, that one either. Unless we are. No, we're not here. And I don't think we're in this suburb. Nope. So, could we have come in like this way? Doesn't seem likely either. This road is fairly straight. So, and we're going east into summer day. And so we're not here. I just hope the map has kept up with the times here. Ah, oh, here we are. There's the Vicente. And we were on this road here. Oh, God. Oh, wow. Um. <laughs> oh, there's a row of houses over there. Or buildings. That might be... Uh, oh, God, know what that is. I'm looking to the south. So we got those things down here. Oh my word, how am I even? There's nothing really for me to count either. That thing over there, I think, is this one. And if I'm standing north... I could actually be in a good spot here. Let's try that. Well, not quite. Right, that's a point to the game, 30.15. And I'm still on 31 minutes, but we're not going to go that far because I've got 8 minutes to go here, so 27 is. Okay, John uh, Gredje. Oh, that was a hard one. But I think I saw that. No. I thought I saw that name, but I didn't. Um, but yeah. Dian. No, Dian Dian. No, Dian. I think I'll leave that to the Hungarians to pronounce properly. I'm just making a right pig's ear out of it. Well, I'll just have to see whether I can remember that name. And there we go. Let's see if we can find a cross. Well, actually, that's pretty dumb of me. Let's go into town and see if we find a crossroads in town. That's usually where you find them. to get a feeling that Jan Juredje is far from a big town. That was it? Oh, wow. Okay. Um, Jan Juredje. Something like that. And now we come to oh Janure Janogeredia Janogeredia. Right. Okay. So it comes in bits and pieces. This seems to be the proper part of the village. Yeah. Well, I 
So now we're going down to the church. Diano Redia. Diano Geredia. Hard name to remember. Oh no, I'll, I'll remember it when I see it, see it on the map. This is a tricky one. Of course, when I figure out where it is on the map, it should be easier to locate, be given that bridge we were at. Okay, so here we Pushpak Molnari and Vos... 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 Okay. Phew, the names. Um... Vosvard. Um... Pushpak... Uh, <laughs> I am no closer to figure out uh, where I am. Okay, let's go on a little. We can afford a cup, a minute or two of trying to find any of these names. Hmm. Here we are. Diano and Diano Geregia. So we were in Geregia. On the Sandor Petefi Street. And the Kosovo Lajos. You'll see that these, these names are all over the place. These are famous names in uh, in Hungary. Um, okay, so we are actually midway between these two bits of river. But we're not on the bit that has a house on it. So we're here. Thereabouts. Ha! And we are. So, with the exception of that round in the field, we are now 40-15 up in the fourth game of the first set of the third match. And, um, yeah, that was also quite quite an enjoyable map, and uh, played well within the stipulated maximum times. So, I guess I might have to go even harder on myself in later matches, but okay, well, we will play this match to its to its end and see where things wind up. So that is episode 43, I think it was. Please check it tomorrow for the next episode. Until then, bye-bye.